Hey, Dr. Peyton here and welcome to week two of our four week concentration, all things skin. The weather is starting to change and I wanted to present small changes that we can make to help with the drying of the skin when it comes down to weather. So here we go. Last week we talked about B12. This week we're going to do oil pulling. Oil pulling is an ancient practice where people took oil, swished it around in their mouths, sesame seed oil, and it would help to rid the body or rid the mouth of bacteria. Well, if we move forward into present day, we found that coconut oil, organic of course, is antibacterial and antiviral. What you do is you take a tablespoonful of coconut oil. Now I keep my coconut oil in a warm area because I don't like globs of material floating around in my mouth. That's just personal preference. But I take a tablespoonful, push it in, put it into my mouth, get dressed before I start my day and I move about my day. After about 15 to 20 minutes, I spit it out. There's a whole technique of oil pulling, so I'd like for you to take a look at that so that I don't make the videos too long. But at any rate, not only is coconut oil antibacterial and antiviral and great for oral health, but it's also wonderful for keeping the skin moisturized. When we talk about moisture, we're not talking about just oil. Putting oil on your skin, I know that shea butter and coconut butter and all those things are wonderful. They're great for their own properties, but oil does not give you moisture. You have to have water in the equation as well. So one of the wonderful benefits of oil pulling is when you mix the oil with the, with the water in your mouth, it, your body, will absorb and there you go. It's like lotion on the inside fantastic way of helping to combat the stresses of the winter months. Give it a try. Tell me what you think. Don't forget, try it with the organic oil. That's a whole nother discussion. Small changes.